Hi, this is Ashwarya and in this tutorial we'll see what is storefront UI and how we can use it in our view storefront. Storefront UI is an open source library based on Google Retail UX playbook dedicated to e-commerce and it's highly optimized for mobile user experience. The view storefront theme Capybara is built using storefront UI. So here is my custom component which I created using view storefront guide to make your own component and it looks like this. To check uh, different components available in storefront UI you can visit this storefront UI documentation. This guide comes with list of components and their details like props, slots, best usage scenario etc. As Capybara theme is built using storefront UI we can directly access it in our component just by simply importing it. For this tutorial let's add a heading which will look like this in our component. We can simply import the SF heading in our component tell the app that we'll use this component add the component in our theme and simply add the data which is used here for the SF heading. So I have saved this file and let's see how it looks in our component. It's taking a bit time in loading. So you can see that as it's shown in most common usage scenario, we have our heading and it's come with subtitle. Now let us try to change some properties which are given here. Let's try to change the CSS custom CSS properties like if I want to change the subtitle color I can simply use this and change it to any color it's changed. Now let us add some more component maybe a link. To add another component we'll just copy this name import it here in the same import statement we'll tell that we'll use this component here we'll use the data this is our SF link Okay, so here's our link. Check this out. Great, it's working. Let's try to tweak this link also. Mm, 
link color let's try link color prop css property let's make it blue great it's working so similarly we can use any of the component here here are list of all the components we have atoms then we have molecules and organisms and uh, we can simply import the component tell that we'll use this component if we need any kind of data for it and then simply we can paste this template for our component and like this we can use component in our custom component of view storefront thanks